prayer. Turn, if you would, to the book of Isaiah this morning, Isaiah chapter 62. Isaiah 62. need some watchmen on the walls is what we need. And it says in verse 6, On your walls, O Jerusalem, I have set watchmen all the day and all the night. They shall never be silent. You who put the Lord in remembrance, take no rest and give Him no rest. Bombard the throne of grace with requests for renewal and revival. Give him no rest until he establishes Jerusalem and makes it a praise in the earth. Some of you have studied the history of John Knox a little bit, the great Protestant reformer in Scotland. And it's said that John Knox had a very simple prayer. Do you remember what that prayer was? I think it was about six words. Give me Scotland or I die. Give me Scotland or I die. And guess what? God gave him Scotland. It's not the length of the prayer. And obviously it's wrapped up in the sovereignty of God who chooses when and how He is going to work in this world and in our midst. And nonetheless, this is the disposition of the psalmist. It should be the disposition of us. Lord, give us America or we die. Come and work in our day. May the gospel go forward in power. May we know something of what the Apostle Paul confessed in Romans 1 when he said he was not ashamed of the gospel of Christ because it is the power of God unto salvation to everyone who believes. And we come before our God like Knox of old and say, O Lord, give us America or we die. Let us pray.